guys and welcome to my 48 week slash 11 month post-op RNY gastric bypass update. My surgery took place on March the 2nd, 2018 at the Guelph General Hospital here in Ontario, Canada. My surgeon's name was Dr. Natasha Pereira Hong. My highest weight was 392 pounds. My surgery weight was 317 pounds. And my current weight, you'll have to wait to find out later on in this video. All right, well, it's been a decent week yet again. Um, I am going to the eye doctor on Thursday, this coming Thursday, so we'll see how that goes and how horrible my eyesight truly is. It's gonna be good to actually hear, like I, I physically know how bad it is, but being told how bad it is and what they can do to help me, you know, see better is going to be interesting because I've never done this before, so I, I don't know what to expect, but we'll see how that goes. Again, I'll probably be sporting glasses here soon. I don't know if you guys have been suffering with the cold like we have. I know some of you have, but this is how we had to keep our house warm. Look how I'm trying to keep warm, guys. It's come to this. I have all the heaters on full blast and it's still freezing in here. So yeah, this is how I'm trying to keep the house warm right now. It's so sad. Because we have like a three story, four bedroom townhouse and every single heater was on in the house and we have um, electric space heaters like baseboard heaters, whatever you call them. Um, and it was still freezing in the house and I was wearing like two layers of clothing. I had on my gym clothes under my regular clothes, three pairs of socks. I felt like I had to put on my coat. So this is how we had to um, keep the house warm. <laughs> it's kind of weird, but you know, you do what you gotta do, right? Um, Speaking of the gym, I went to, I went six times last week. On Friday, I went twice. So not six days, but five full days, but twice on Friday. So that was a win. i um, happy about that. And also on Friday, Friday evening, I think it was Friday, Thursday or Friday, I called one of our good friends here on YouTube and R and Y, I'll put her link right here. But we spoke on the phone for four hours and it was so nice. It felt like I really had a friend in real life, you know, it was so cool. We were talking about, you know, things that we might end up doing this summer and it was just a lot of fun. Um, just, it felt good, you know, to talk to somebody other than just family. No offense to family, of course, I love my family, but, it was just different, you know? Anyways, let's get into my weigh-in for this week, shall we? As you can see, I managed to lose, again, the same amount of weight that I lost last week. I lost 3.2 pounds this week, which makes it a total of 112 pounds since my surgery and 187 pounds total. I'm only 13 pounds away from 200 pounds lost. And better yet, I'm only six pounds away from Wonderland from the 100s. I cannot believe that. My goal was to hit that by March the 2nd. So I have about, you know, a little over three weeks to get there. And it's starting to feel like it, it's a reality. It may actually happen after all. I never thought I would ever get this. This is the lowest weight I have been since I was about 15 years old. That's just insane to me. I have been morbidly obese my entire life. I'm still considered morbidly, well, not morbidly obese, just obese now. But that's insane to me. I'm gonna be in the 100s. 
hopefully by March 2nd. That's my ultimate goal. So I need to lose six pounds. I don't know if I could do that, but we'll see. We will see. Um, anyways, let's get into my belly shot for this week, shall we? Makes my legs look smaller. This is super heavy. body like that like without this I look almost like a normal person how crazy but because of this I'm never gonna look normal Ugh. so gross but that's my body this is what my thighs look like. At 11 months. Look at that cottage cheese. very well but this is why I wear shorts swimming <laughs> Any difference? I think there is. I don't know. Again, in the back of my mind, I have Ange yelling at me because she's like, you know what? Shut up with that. I don't see a difference. Um, you know, is there a difference? No, or whatever. I usually say at the end of doing my my belly shot, and yeah, I, I don't know. I I kind of am seeing a difference now. Um, I don't know. It's, it's kind of weird. Like, not much difference from last week, but overall, yeah, of course there's going to be a difference. But, I don't know. I just, I'm happy. I'm happy with the changes I'm making. And it, not going to lie, it's been hard work. It has been very, very hard because exercising is something I've never done in my entire life, you know. I rode my stationary bike. That's basically all I was doing. And I got up to like 45 minutes, 50 minutes. I think an hour was the longest I've ever done, you know, back when I was trying to, um, you know, lose weight before. But I had it on like zero resistance. It was just, you know, just pedaling. There was no resistance whatsoever. So, yeah. That's literally the only type of exercise I've ever done aside from walking. And now I'm doing everything. I'm doing weights, you know, I'm, 
I'm doing planks. Those, by the way, are the hardest things for me to do. Out of everything that I do, planks are the thing that I I hate the most. I, oh my gosh. I'm like counting those seconds because it hurts. It hurts so much. But yeah, it's pain with a purpose, right? But yeah, I'm going to keep this video short for realsies this time. I know I say that all the time, but I really don't have much to update. Um, next week, I'll be going to see, to my job preparation interview or whatever you want to call it. But um, this week, the only thing I really have planned is the eye doctor. Yeah, my daughter, she's going to see Glass without me tonight with her boyfriend. Oh, she's not paying attention, but <laughs> yeah, I want to see that movie so bad too, but she said she'll see it again with me. But yeah, that's probably all I have for you guys this week. Sorry, it's a very boring, boring video, but we just got home from the gym. I have to make my lunch here, um, and I guess I'll speak to you later on this week sometime. I have another video coming of me um, doing a little mini tour around my gym so you can see how big it actually is and you know the equipment and a little bit of me working out just to do something you know between tags and these videos I really don't have much content because my life isn't really that exciting so you know if you want to watch it feel free if you don't then don't it's it's fine it's just I want to have something out there for you guys if, you know, for those of you who actually are interested in the things that I do. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to insert a before and after shot for my 11 month update at the end of this video. So you can see my progression on where I came from and where I am today. All right. I hope you all have a wonderful week and I will see you again next time. <laughs> Bye for now guys.